Now more than ever, it's important to have what I'd like to call real talk with our young people. So I'm excited that I have Ella Unruh, a freshman at Providence High School, joining us this morning. Ella also has been in the Great Day Live studio and treated us to her absolutely beautiful, talented singing voice. Ella, how are you? I'm great. How are you doing? Doing really great now that you've joined us. So what does this look like? I mean, you're you're a freshman in high school and you have obviously not gone to school for quite a few weeks now. So what does a typical day look like for you now that you're incorporating online instruction into your world? Right. Well, I've been actually trying to uh, get a routine together. I think that that's really important. I've heard advice from people that um, making your own routine is very necessary in this time. It's because it's really hard for all of us. So um, I get up in the morning, I check in with my first block teacher. Um, I do my work. Um, if I'm really efficient, like I like to be, then I can get it really, um, get it done really fast. Um, and I really enjoy being able to stay in touch with um, my teachers and my friends. And I've had so much help. It, like, I don't feel alone at all in this. Um, I feel very uh, blessed to have that opportunity to be in touch with um, the amazing, amazing educators I have. So what about your fellow classmates, your friends? I mean, what's the overall I'm not asking you to speak on behalf of anyone, certainly, but what's the overall environment or attitude, especially for individuals who are, I mean, freshmen in high school looking at their sophomore year? Right. We're obviously really um upset that we can't see each other in person. I know that um, I love my high school so much. I enjoyed every day I was there. So it's kind of crazy to be um, away from it for so long, but we're trying to have a positive outlook. Um, technology um, is extremely um, important during these times. And I'm so thankful for that because um, I can FaceTime my friends at any point in the day and we still keep in touch very well. So without that, I feel like it would be um, a lot harder, but um, I'm really thankful for that. Now, what about your brother? I know that the two of you have a tremendous bond. Yes, we're best friends. So, um, you know, I'll just peek in his room sometimes and he'll come out and we'll do something together. But it's nice to have somebody that um, is always there for me, especially when I may get lonely. Um, and I'm really happy to have him in my life. And he's been a great support. Now, you front a popular band. So how has that, how, what's occurring right now, how has that changed things for you? And what are you doing to make sure that you're staying at the top of your game, but also having a little fun at it too? Right. So I miss my band so much. Uh, we we meet at least one time a week. Um, and since we haven't been able to do that, um, I miss them, but I keep practicing my songs on my set list. We have um, a gig book, booked on June 6th, um, and we're hoping that doesn't get postponed, but um, we're super excited for this summer. That's when we are most busy, and we're trying to uh, keep in touch and make sure that we're staying on top of our game by just doing what we do best, practicing. And last question, and I ask this frequently of guests from all walks of life, what is one way that you make it work during this time that maybe might be inspiring, uplifting, or let someone who's watching this right now know, you know what, I'm not alone in this. Oh yeah, um, the music industry in its entirety has brought me so much support. I write music all the time. Um, I'm working on releasing a few and I anxiously await the release of one of my new ones. Um, so I've been writing music, but just, partaking in the things that you love and don't let something like this um, stop you from, from doing those things. I know that I've continued to write music. I, um, I post some songs that I do on my Instagram account so people can hear me and um, I can reach out to them. And I think mainly just realizing that there's so much love around you and I look forward to all the love I can put out soon. So, Well, we appreciate you sharing some of that love here this morning on Great Day Live. Thank you, Ella. Thank you very much. If you want to connect with Ella and hear that beautiful voice that I hope to have back in our studio once again, maybe in the coming months, just find Ella Unruh's dot, Ella Unruh dot sings on Instagram. Thanks, Ella. Thank you.